Hello Virgo, welcome. I'm Ryan, and thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you may be dealing with. Of course, everything may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel. I found the three tarot pictures to review as well. Thank you. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> what is that about? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, Virgo. Who are you asking about today? Who is this? You've, you've sparked my curiosity. I want to know who this is. You're like, that, that. Someone else showed me this exact same energy, and I'm like, really? That? Um, oh, goodness, and there you are, Virgo, showing up. What is this? Oh my goodness. Um, one more, then I'll jump in. I want to know. I want to know. Right away, this is something else. Um... This could go one or two ways, Virgo. Um, what you're kind of showing me is that, yes, you are showing me you, but you're also showing me them. Um, there's an event, there's a party, there's a social gathering. I don't know what the celebration is about, what it's for, but whatever this event or party or social gathering is, they feel as if there's new love forming or being created here. Now, what's very interesting about this, I kind of, for some reason, I was laughing because I'm like, someone poured someone a drink they never had before, and they're kind of like, ooh, shit, I love this. And immediately they get hooked. Um, whatever this new love is, not only is there strong emotions and feelings, there also is that hook. So someone here is addicted or fixated or obsessed about something so much so that they are having to literally contain themselves. Now, this could be an open relationship. It could be an open situation or dynamic. I don't exactly know. Um, it definitely has this non-traditional energy attached and written all over it at the same time. They're trying to figure out what to do regarding plans moving forward. What to do about the situation. This could be a third party situation. Could be, you know, like I said, open relationship. Don't know. Could be just, a, you know, a party of some sort. Um, they're very happy with the plans. And I'm not too sure if these plans are with you or not with you. But they're showing me this over energy of what's there to think about. Let's just move forward. Even though they're kind of showing me this energy of they're a little bit standoffish and guarded with you, Virgo. Um... It seems like they're moving forward and they're feeling pretty good about themselves and the situation and what's going on. But it also seems it feels like they're not in full 100% control of themselves. So either they want to agree to go along with this or not. This is kind of like saying I've, I've, I've drank so much. Yeah, I'm going along with it. But consciously, they're kind of like, I'm not too sure if I'm cool with this. 100% cool with this. But they're moving forward with it either way. They're saying, energetically speaking... They're already kind of taxed out or spent or burnt. But there is something here they're wanting to find out more about. Oh my gosh. And what a mess indeed, Virgo. What a mess indeed. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay. Um, There's a lot of, how do I say this? There's a lot, geez, the dynamic. It's like, I don't really wish, I, I don't, I don't. Whatever this is with this dynamic, it almost, I have to be honest here, it almost seems and feels like someone is trying to learn exactly how something works, um, how this whole dynamic works, possibly. Even though they're kind of showing me this energy of, new love is being formed they're also becoming addicted it's an energy of now lust is involved now temptation is involved that sort of thing the more it's like they're like i said they're, they're moving along with this at the same time they're also having like this guilty conscious kick in um where it seems and feels like yeah something great's going on and they're kind of like in the back of their mind they're like yeah but it's not that great and so it's kind of like you know one voice on one shoulder the other voice on the other shoulder regarding the situation the circumstances they are wondering why something's not actually progressing or moving along further, whether it's in the connection, whether it's in the relationship, whether it's in the living situation. They're showing me that there is some type of living situation, but at the same time, it's almost like because of the circumstance of the situation, they're being, how do I say this? For some reason, with whatever they're learning about, there's something regarding they're in a battle or fight with themselves. Their perspective, what they want, what they desire, what it's actual, what actual true happiness and fulfillment is. They're at a battle with themselves. Because of the living situation, they're being, I gotta say it, they are being, I'm not gonna say manipulative, but for some reason they're saying that they're being justified with not taking care of shit. They're saying, I'm not gonna do shit. I'm gonna put everything else on hold. Even though there's problems and there's issues here, I'm realizing they're kind of like, I'm choosing not to deal with anything because deep down, they're actually torn. That They're torn with themselves. looking at three 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 um they're stressing virgo they are stressing and it's, it's almost as if they're stressing so much they're still fingers crossed hoping for the best possible outcome or result from the situation with everyone um this overall energy of strongly believing that something can still turn out for the best excuse me drink responsibly it's almost as if they have to kind of work up their own confidence just to say something or express something to you about wanting to work on things with everyone in this whole dynamic, even though there's this energy of like the dynamic in it itself. They're saying three's a party, yes, but it's also too crowded. Um, they're hoping for just two. So I don't know what the dynamic is between the two of you specifically, but they're kind of saying, um, trying to keep everything going and keeping everything on track, that's unfortunate. They're saying something's gotta change because they are not happy, they are not fulfilled, and they're not getting what they want. They feel like they're not being recognized, seen, heard, felt. Um, yeah. They're trying to focus on working on it, but at the same time, they're kind of like, either one, you're going to want to work on it or not, but if not... They're holding themselves, it, geez, ooh how does that make sense? This is someone who's energetically out the door, but they haven't physically done it yet. They're not too sure. They're not too sure. They're in a bit of a bind. Um, of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an earth sign, a fire sign, an air sign, or a water sign. They're all here. <laughs> 